first search regit it in the windows 10 search box okay to open registry editor just click on registry editor to open it now once this registry editor opens up you have to browse to hkey local machine then system then current control set then services and then now in the right side just double click on it and change the value data to 4 and now click on ok and now close the registrator and restart your PC and see if problem has been fixed or not if this does not fix your problem there is one more thing which you can do and that is boot uh, your PC into safe mode now if you have logged in into the computer normally you're able to log in into computer normally then to enter safe mode just search MS config okay and now click on the search result now click on boot and select this safe boot now click on apply and click on okay okay and now restart your PC this will you know restart your PC into safe mode now if you are not being able to log in into your PC normally then to enter safe mode you have to first go into the Windows recovery environment and to enter Windows recovery mode what you have to do is to press the computer power button for uh, to start the computer normally and as soon as the logo appears on the screen logo of the manufacturers appears on the screen like Dell or HP or Lenovo whatever be the logo of the laptop or desktop manufacturer appears on the screen just press power button again for 10 seconds so that it completely turned off okay now repeat this process two to three times and you will see the windows recovery mode screen now once you reach this screen click on troubleshoot now click on advanced options now click on startup settings now click on restart now from here you can enter into safe mode into your computer so if you'll press 4 from your windows keyboard laptop keyboard just 4 you will enter the safe mode now once you reach the safe mode on your windows 10 pc what you have to do is to go to c drive and then go to windows then find intel ppm okay Let's find Intel That's it guys, please do like the video to support us and thanks for watching the Geek page.